Hello, pal collectors. I'm Anthony with Anthony's Comic Book Art. And it's Friday. So Friday, we're trying to get organized. Uh, we got the big Baltimore Con coming up. Uh, we've been very busy doing put-ups and shows and art drop shows, you know, from uh, a couple weeks ago to this week. And I think we got a Dueling Dealers coming up next week. And I'm going to be at the Mignola show next week. And then we go to... Baltimore Comic Con. So if you have any wants for Baltimore, you're going to be an attendee there. And you want to make sure we bring it and put it aside for you, even just to look at it. Hey, I want to look at that, uh, you know, Joe Sinnott, West Coast Avengers page and see how beautiful it really is in person because it is. They're all flawless. Look, I have a bunch of these. So this is, this is uh, putaways that we're doing from... Updates. Here's a, a Deadpool cover with a cake on it, Sharon. Yay, cake! Cake. And Yay. Joe Sinnott, <laughs> Devil Slayer. Uh, look at that. Deadpool, Storm, Spider Man, Spider Man. Hey, Wolverine with a cocktail. Wolverine with cocktails. Specially made for your. What's it called? Man Cave. Uh, Hulk Activity Coloring Book. Don't go away. Get close-ups. Need close-ups. God. And then Starshine and Rom. The death of Starshine with Sad Sharon. Look at Sad Sharon. And Bruce Banner. And then Evil Sharon. The Morgan Le Fay. And then some Moon Knight. That's cool. And then uh, Avengers Action. Uh, more Avengers. Thing. Iron Man. Is that Iron Man or is that uh, uh, Rhodes? Hawkeye. Mockingbird. Uh, Avengers Action. Iron Man. Try not to put the price tag over a tiny version of the main hero on the page rich tigra tigra which one is it here's a cool doctor strange avengers page and kazar from astonishing tales wolverine x-men and cerebro is sharing and then well, this is Wolverine and Old Man Logan. Man, I could watch that movie again and again. You put on Old Man Logan the other day. Why? Why? I just can watch that movie all the way through every time. So good. So good. All right, so Patrick Stewart should have won an Academy Award for Best Supporting Actor in that, that movie. Oh, we got a really cool uh, strip art and illo. Deal in Frank Robbins, football, horse racing, boxing, Frank Robbins, Sherlock Holmes, Sherlock Holmes, productions. Uh, I mean, you know, nobody was selling color guides until I did a deal with 10,000 of them in there. We still have all, this is color guides right here. You know, we, we sell them every day. I don't discount color guides anymore. I'm doing deals for color guides, uh, bulk deals. Uh, like at Terrificon, what did I, well, I must've picked up about 100, 150 of them, just in bulk deals because uh, other people aren't willing to do the work. We put them up and, and uh, people buy them every day every day here's the uh, published cover this was one of those 30th anniversary variants uh so that was what last year last year 93 right mm -hmm. 93 to 2000 uh, yeah 20, must have been right yeah must have been last year oh here's a cool uh this is really cool i started to break this out on the art drop show this is a 12 o'clock high issue uh, TV related from the show this is page one two and three large art by Joe Sinnott 
And my favorite part of this is this actor who is the uh, lead in 12 O'Clock High TV show, which the movie uh, with Gregory Peck is one of my favorite all-time movies. Uh, he was Gary Seven on Star Trek, that episode of Star Trek. With Terry Gar, when Terry Gar was his funny secretary, and he was the human super trained by alien, a super advanced alien race to save the Earth. And then at the end, this is uh, the lore of that episode because he was a very established actor and he had been in World War II, and so had Gene Roddenberry. And Gene Roddenberry had done a, a, uh, service related show before that called the lieutenant anyway they liked each other he liked him and at the very last scene they they kind of tease it to go into a spin-off show with with uh this actor and terry gar uh but that never happened anyway so but that's the lore of that episode that it was going to be a star trek spin-off show Anyway, so I did a deal uh, yesterday, in fact, for this whole romance book by Jack Katz. And uh, it's cool. And my favorite page is, is that they're having a roll in the hay. A roll in the hay. Look at that. Roll in the hay romance page. <laughs> and he's a rock star. So there's some really fun pages in here. 16 new romance pages. This is what, 68? Oh, 73. 73, we got some beheadings, more strip art, the Joe Sinnott twice up pages, those Marvel pages. Here's some more of that uh, the strip art. Uh, what else? We got DC Humor covers. It's got Valley on it. And Oh, look, if I would have had uh, known I had this at the Terrific Con, look at that. It's Canoe! So, and then for you budget collectors uh, in the deal, uh, the big Joe Sinnott deal I did, uh, I have some nice uh, prints that are signed by Joe 25 years ago. Oh, look. You know who that is. And then these are, uh, I really like these. These are uh, 11 by 17 prints with the remark by Joe Sinnott. So we had those at about a hundred, hundred and a quarter. What else? What other some highlights? This is a DC stack. We got Batman. Uh, that's another strip. Let's see, let's go through the DC uh, pile. We got a cool big Batman. Justice League, Superman, Supergirl, Helen Slater. So my my uh, story about Helen Slater is that her mother was a big casting director in New York. And when I was trying to be an actor boy, I went in and saw her and she hit on me and threw me off so bad. I did a terrible audition and then she, by the end of it, she's like, how did you even get this audition? Anyway, so uh, Green Lantern, Andy McDonald, Superman Family, uh, Wonder Woman with the space shuttle. That's Hal Jordan. You can see his ring. And then this really cool Challengers of the Unknown. Uh, another uh, Justice League with uh, Batman and Hawkman. I guess you'd call this fanzine art fanzine got a bunch of archie if you like archie this i'm kind of surprised it's still here look at this how big this is if you like jrjr you can get a nice daredevil profile or this giant wolverine so got a lot of stuff putting away getting ready for the baltimore show again if you're going to be in baltimore let us know with wants especially like smaller stuff you know, oh, can you bring these two color guides? We won't have the color guides there. We will have maybe some highlights or a print or anything like that. If you're in the in the lower range of uh, stuff, B 
be sure and let us know what you would like and we will bring it to that show for you. No problem. Even if you want something from the eBay store, no problem. Comics, magazines, whatever. All right, so I'm Anthony with Anthony's Comic Book Art. Stay in touch with the website for all this art goodness and then the eBay store with over 159,000 listings and over uh, 90,000 positive feedback. Uh, we will be sure we want to make customers on eBay like nobody's business. It's our business to make customers on eBay. Okay? So, stay in touch with uh, the uh, Comic Art Live for a Dueling Dealers next week, I believe, and then the Baltimore Con. I'm Anthony with Anthony's Comic Book Art. You keep calm, keep collecting, and get a laugh from my wife, my wife. And we'll see you in the chat.